So, when you're very, when you're sitting on a desk, you know, it's a posture thing, you know, you like to sit on the desk, your, your, your back gets all sore from, uh, and you usually have pain in the back, right? But I usually say the knot is in the front and this becomes an elongated muscle, right? And one of the favorite things that people like to do is like stretch like this, what I personally do too. I just do it with my feet, I do it with my up. But um, like I said, this is what's going on with your body, all right? So all the knots are in the front, all the knot is in the front, so these knots are the contracted muscles and what happens is your elongated muscles your back muscles your back muscles back here are elongated so in this case it'll be this part of the knot it'll be this part of the rubber band where it is elongated okay and what you're doing is actually when you're doing this all you're doing is stretching elongated muscles what happens to stretching and elongated muscles not much you know you're just it's already loose and weak and elongated some might be strong but it's already elongated so it's already a stretched out muscle so what you're doing is actually what you what you're affecting is actually the bones of it so when you're doing it it's actually the joints what i like to do for personally i like to like crack my back when i'm doing this so it'll feel better but remember that, that you're just hurting your body more. And this is, it took me a long time to think about this for a while because when you're, it's the muscles that support the joints and bones, okay? So your bones are this and your muscles like keeping it, the two sides of it, keeps in keeping the joints and the back muscle upright. So if it's elongated like this and you're just cracking the bone and the joints, it, it, it's not, there's not much, that's going on. So um, that's cracking the joints, cracking the joints when your muscle is elongated and trying to stretch the back.